Hey, this is John Carlos, and I'm here with a look at the Funko Pop of the Brain from Pinky and the Brain. This Brain Pop looks great. The pose he's in is just perfect. I love the arms behind the back. It conveys, you know, intelligence and a little bit of condescension. He's clearly explaining a plan to Pinky that Pinky doesn't get. It's a great pose. The, uh, the, the, the feet and how they meet the legs the way they plug in look good. You can see there's a little itty bitty bit of a gap there because they are plugged in, but still they look pretty good. I like the contrast between the two. I think his tail turned out great. I think the sculpt of it's great. The paint's really clean. The paint on his hands looks good in the back. The plumpiness of his uh, body, his little you know, lower torso looks good. Uh, yeah, great job with the tail. Great job with everything. Eyeballs look good. I love the angry lines that that do not finish the full circle uh not quite angry but you know what i mean he does get upset at pinky quite a bit uh i love the sculpted ridges here for his uh his brows they look really cool it's subtle i like it also subtle little gray lines little bags under his eyes this one's nose paint is really good i say this one because when i was hunting for this in stores i saw a bunch that had really bad nose paint so be on the lookout for that especially when it smears onto the white and you know kind of ruins the figure but this figure here great superb looking i love it looks great on the shelf i'm a big fan of pinky and the brain both the original show and animaniacs so i love having a pop of the brain here love it thanks for watching everybody and follow me on instagram and facebook and all that stuff